Welcome back. We're gonna start off with some candy cane trumpet curls on the frag rack, focusing on the right hand side of the tank. A couple close up, somewhat macro shots. Uh, all the water parameters are doing well. Uh, put it in the carbon, really cleared up the water. So here is a head on shot. We're gonna be focusing on the right hand side. Tons of 60 40, primarily on that frag rack. Close ups, clean that glass side panel today. It's kind of a pain to get to uh, because of the wave maker and the frag rack. Um, cleaning it without putting your hands in the tank can be a little bit challenging. Um, the wave pump and the frag rack are pretty much on the same level and picked up these frags the other day they're doing well uh, believe it or not the blues are still on on the kessel it's just the camera is really close um, the light in the frag rack is really close to the surface of the water so the big takeaway i wanted to highlight um, is adding a millipore uh, right there is a green one um, it's kind of a intro level aquapore, um, but yeah, it seems to be doing well. Um, the tank is definitely much, much more stable. Um, and then there's bird nests. I rescued the bubblegum digi. I fragged it into two pieces. Um, that bright green cephastria in the background that's growing on the overflow box. Uh, it is... Uh, it jumped onto the rock and so it overtook the bubblegum digi. So another close-up of the Millie. And I need to find a place in the tank. This side is not getting as much light. I don't really rotate them. So top-down view. It's a little blurry. I didn't turn off the return pump. Um, but it just gives another angle. Again, overall, the water parameters are doing well. Uh, no changes there. Towards the end of the video, I'll show you how fast the water flow is through the algae reactor, which the pump is in the return pump section, pulls water from the last section of the sump and places it back into the first section of the sump, which is still the refugium. Uh, so here I turned off the Tunzi wave maker on that side. Um, but the ripples effect from the return pump. Close up shot, refugium is doing well. The algae, uh, the chatomorpha in the algae reactor stopped spinning. Um, so it reminded me to turn it off, which inadvertently had me check for those events where, say, my algae reactor turns off, my return pump turns off, and let's say the calcium reactor turns off. I'm right up to the top of the water line of um, the rim. The water line comes right up to the rim of the sump. So that's all I have for tonight. Thanks for watching. Till next time.